All right, all right, listen. I know I said a couple of things, right? I said that I was going to go live. Sorry. Can't. Got QT time with the wife, man. You know, that is precious, especially when you don't got no kids right now. Got to do that. But I also said that the Philadelphia Eagles should blow out the Cleveland Browns. That didn't happen. But I think the score doesn't pertain to what actually happened on the field. It's a lot of things that I like. No turnovers from Jalen Hurts. That is a plus. That is the first game I like nine with no turnovers. Got a shout out to that. And the defense, they played out of their mind. Only giving up really one touchdown and some field goals. I like it. I like where this team is heading. I know a lot of people, they going to be down. They saying, yeah, but it's a win. Let's talk about it, y'all. Yo, that. Hit with it worse. Cut it to the one start. Then our season just got put in the hearse. But I feel like it's a gift and a curse. We learn from it. And we don't stay stuck on that page. We turn from it. Lost Kelsey, but ain't stopping nothing. Still going to run up on them steps till we rocky something. Put your corner right on ice with Smitty Hockey something. This and white right up the middle, but a block or something. Uh, all my birds come correct. No, they ready to battle. Stole Saquon from New York. Took a body. They yer, yer. Yo, that man. You know who it is. You know what it is. Your boy, Philly Fresh. AKA the general heavy pull for duty. Listen, if you haven't done that, make sure you hit that sub button that's right now. That, 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 there you go. Yes, and also, it is the bell and so the let you know, put the ball to slave the notification game. Yo, that game. Yo, that. Please, please hit the like button for your boy. However, the algorithm works. More people get to see me and more people get to see the merch and the merch is on fire. Shout out to Print Chance for being a sponsor of this video. Shout out to them, man. Seriously, make sure y'all go cop up. This video is also brought to you by Shafir's Journey. I ain't going to talk. I'm going to let them talk. Go ahead. Shafir is paralyzed from the waist down, an innocent bystander caught in the path of bullets not meant for him. I was in a park waiting for a friend to play basketball with, and somebody had ski mask on. He came to the park on a, on a bike. He just pulled a gun from out of his pocket. I started running. He shot about four times, hit me in the back over here, and went through here all the way to my side. All right, make sure y'all go hit both links in the description, man. Please, please. All right, we got to get to it. Fresh fact of the day is, fresh fact of the day is, listen, when you out here and you're doing what you're supposed to be doing, good things come to you. It might not come when you want. It might not come at the time when you need it. But guarantee they will come. Just keep doing what you're supposed to be doing and you will reap the benefits. All right. The benefit of the day is the Philadelphia Eagles get a win. The Philadelphia Eagles get a win. I understand it's 20 to 16. The score looks bad. Not scoring again this whole season in the first quarter is catastrophic to me. I don't like it. But I think that. They're figuring it out. When I say they, I mean the coaching staff and Jalen Hurts are figuring out the best way to attack defenses, the best way to get Jalen Hurts in a rhythm. And Jalen Hurts definitely got into a rhythm during the second quarter and beyond. I thought the defense started, I mean, the offense started a couple of times, but the defense came to play. Cooper DeGene, I don't know why in the hell, he has not been acclimated and being a focal point in his defense the whole year. They said he didn't get out the Vic Fangio scheme or whatever the case may be, but the kid looks good. He looked good. That boy, that boy good. Listen, man. <laughs> Listen, Quenyon Mitchell and Cooper Jean, they they are everything that we asked for. Quenyon Mitchell, I don't even think he I don't even think he gave up any and like any yards today if he did comment below let me know and if it was it wasn't nothing crazy i thought that the defense all around i thought jalen carter and it's going to be some things when i say this y'all going to say well he wasn't that dominant look at the stats no i'm looking at the tape i'm looking at what i've seen i'm playing back see it, it, it's a reason why i don't go I don't go live because I like to run. I like to run the game back and look at things from a different perspective. And I'm looking at John Carter. He was an absolute beast. He was getting held on a lot of plays, but he was very disruptive. And Jordan Davis played a good game too. Nolan Smith. Nolan Smith was balling. 
Nolan Smith was balling, man. Like, I think he need more snaps. Uh, you didn't see that much of Bryce Huff. Once again, Bryce Huff had did not do nothing. He held up to his jersey number with a zero stat. Nothing. Nada. Kapoop. But it is what it is. Vic Fangio is finding a way to get over that. Even though you paid this man how much you paid him, like $48 million. But it is what it is. We got to win football games. Um, Nicobe Dean. Uh, I'm at Bryce Huff. If I said Nicobe Dean, I'm sorry. I'm at Bryce Huff getting paid all that money. Nicobe Dean. Why in the hell you keep whiffing on these tackles? What the hell is going on? Deshaun Watson shook you out your boots twice. And then it was a key play on third down that you should have brought the linebacker down. And yet and still you whiffed. You with. I don't understand why Devin White didn't get the start. I don't understand it. Maybe it was something internally that was really going on, but I don't like it. But he's not here anymore. But Nicobe Dean is, and I'm not gonna say he played a bad game, but it was key moments when he is singled out and the spotlight is on him. He does not make the play unless it's him going downfield and making and, and making a play behind the line of scrimmage. Anything above the line of scrimmage, he's barbecue chicken. But that ain't what we're really here for. we really here to celebrate the win. Uh, Jalen Hurts played his best game. It might not be stat-wise. I understand he threw for 300 a couple games, but he played his best game. You want to know why? It was clean. You want to know why? He made good decisions. You want to know why? He didn't put the ball in harm's way. He didn't put the ball on the ground. He was solid. Dallas Goddard's go. Dallas got to go down. He finds a uh, uh, Calcaterra. He finds AJ Brown. He finds Devontae Smith. Both for touchdowns. And that dom, that dom at the end of the game. It was risky. And when the ball was in the air, I'm like, what are they doing? Yes, you know how you got that thing. Like, no, no, but yes, yo. I'm like, yo, what's what? Like what? But. It was completed. AJ Brown is just a monster, and that was a that was a dime, that was a dime, and the Philadelphia Eagles come out victorious. Now we got two road games coming up against the Giants, against Cincinnati, and we should win both of those. So now that we're looking at it, we three and two, right? At the end of this little situation, when you got uh, Cincinnati, I mean, you got the giant Cincinnati and then Jacksonville, you should be six and two. And then we having a whole nother discussion because the team that I seen today, other than not really putting up points, especially in the first quarter, and that's going to come, I think can be dominant. I know can be dominant. AJ Brown back Lane Johnson goes down. And it's like, damn. Damn, we can't, we, we we just can't stay healthy. Then who else goes down? Uh, Isaiah Rogers goes down, he comes back. Darius Slay goes down, hope he get a speedy recovery. And I was looking for an excellent game from him, but it is what it is. This Philadelphia Eagles is bound to go on a run. That's all I got for right now. Got to get to the wife. But y'all already know, man, stay Philly, stay fresh. Let me know what y'all think in the comments, man. Am I tripping? Am I tripping on being happy with this win? Yo, that.